We're just getting another Bloomberg headline crossing the Bloomberg terminal saying that uh, the Turkish lira has depreciated as much as 4.2 percent versus the dollar. Does this have to do with mechanisms in the markets? Are people worried about a rating cut this afternoon? Or is this because actually the, the, the first sanctions from the U.S. if the pastor is not, you know, immediately released really have, you know, become much more problematic? I, I would be very surprised if it's due to um, international investors. Uh, effectively, the uh, Turkish lira has become untradeable. Uh, so it's you can't. Market. Yeah, so you can't. Um, you know, if, even where, if you're trying to even go long, yeah. um, it's very it's, difficult yeah. to get uh, sort of forward points on that. So um, it may be some, you know, squaring of positioning perhaps by uh, local banks, perhaps in anticipation. Um, that we are going to see a rating cut later from uh, SMP. Uh, I mean, I'd be very surprised if SMP don't cut the rating. I don't think that should really be, and I'm sure it won't be a surprise to the broader market. I think where it raises the issue, and which is absolutely crucial for Turkey going forward, is would it impact the ability of the banks to do their rollovers? That's right. what's going to determine whether they're ultimately successful or not, mm. is whether they can actually roll over the short-term liabilities yeah. um, that they have rather than the lira itself. But David, if capital controls are impalatable, will they end up going to the IMF after possibly you know, several loans, unilateral loans like we saw from Qatar? I do think that ultimately they're going to have to do a combination of higher rates, uh, much tighter policy more generally, and actually need to import some credibility, if you like, even more than external financing, and, and going to the IMF is one way of doing that. I mean, the, that will require a huge political U-turn out of Ankara. Um, so at the moment, I think their strategy is, you know, we're going to take the pain, uh, we're going to tighten fiscal policy, the economy is going to crash, we're going to do import contraction, and we're going to try and basically muddle our way through. I just think they're on a knife edge uh, where that particular strategy can really fail quite dramatically and they're going to have much more, um, uh, much more pain as yeah. a result of that strategy than they otherwise would.